All right, we're getting ready for tomorrow, December 14th, which should be the last day that we can ship uh, bef and still get you things before Christmas from the Gear website store. So we're creating some of these uh, tactical stockings to uh, fill up with good stuff to encourage some sales tomorrow. Uh, we'd love to wrap up 2018 uh, with some sales in the books uh, to give us the uh, opportunity to uh, get as much out of SHOT Show at the beginning of next year as well as a uh, lead on some, well, that's a bad one, <laughs> get a lead on some uh, projects for 2019. So what are we talking about? Uh, we've got all of these uh, tactical stockings that we're going to be filling up with good stuff. Uh, things like our patches, right? So we did a couple here at the Patch Batch. There's like a handful of these media patches left. Uh, they will be going out tomorrow. will be the last day to get your hands on those. We did not sell those. They only went out as thank yous. Our uh, Wolverine Squared, we have a few more of these, but they're almost gone as well. A bunch of those will go out tomorrow. Uh, we've got our other patches of from our inventory that we'll be sending out for free because it's free patch Friday. Every Friday when you purchase from the store, you're going to get a free patch. So what makes tomorrow so good. I went through one of the boxes that I used to take to gun shows and I grabbed a bunch of knives in there uh, that weren't selling. So these are going to go uh, along with our patches into some of these stockings. Now, of course, the switchblades will have to depend on uh, where you live. Uh, and maybe that'll apply to this uh, replica trench dagger as well. Uh, but these, well, I guess this one won't fit in the normal size. We'll have to jam this one into the larger Christmas stocking. And uh, speaking of the larger Christmas stocking, that's going to allow us to include one of our Red Dawn uh, bumper stickers. These are dead on to the movie. And we can only ship them in these large bags. So any order over $50, we'll get one of the Red Dawn stickers because then we can afford to put it in the big bat, the big shipping envelope. But uh, everything gets shipped in bubble wrap uh, envelopes, and uh, we'll have these in second envelopes for everybody. This is a cool uh, hollow-gripped um, Mora, but it's got like a increments on the blade. I really like this one. I don't know why I'm selling it or why I was selling it. Now I'm giving it away. Uh, this is a Smith & Wesson uh, neck knife with a whistle in the scabbard here. It's like a neck scabbard, the ball chain, so you can carry it around your neck. Uh, and let's see, they got a diving knife here that's uh, not in new condition or anything, but this would have been a lot of fun when I was a kid, so hopefully I'll get some more use out of it. That'll go into a stocking as well. I found this thing in the thing as well, just some in the wrapper uh, inexpensive multi-tool. We've got some hats from certain places that we visited that gave me hats. I don't usually buy hats. I don't like them because they are too difficult to ship. But uh, the guys at the Billings, uh, Billings, Montana Surplus Stores, one of the coolest surplus stores I visited yet. And I'm not even kidding. They gave me this hat, and I'm going to pass it along to somebody who actually likes hats. If, and if you like surplus stores, man, that thing is the best surplus store ever. Uh, Gallison's, I think I said, in uh, Salt Lake City. Another really cool gun shop, and they're going to have free dog hair all over them. I can't deal with you know nothing I can do about that. Got a multicam hat here, some blue force stuff. I uh, got a couple of different hats that I'll throw into the larger bags when they go out. Hopefully nobody minds them getting smashed up. We've got some of the patches and things like these we picked up in Tulsa. Uh, these were from uh, last year's SAR show. Uh, some Glock stuff from different partners in the industry that have given us stuff over the. Uh, different travels, uh, more swag from different places. We've got some pens and stuff. And uh, th that's our way of saying thanks. We're going to throw some patches in too. We've got a bunch of patches that were given to us from other patch designers here and from uh, D Merit where we'll throw a bunch of stuff in there. We'll make a couple of videos to show uh, just what all's in those prize packages. And those will go out to people who order from our gear website store. And when we talk about ordering from the store, what are we talking about? We're talking about people who purchase our products. Uh, one of the ways that we support what we're doing online here, sharing the Second Amendment, and uh, the way that we do, is uh, through project products. We make these products with our audiences and with our friends in the industry, and uh, we make them here in the United States. I'm proud to say each one of our projects so far has been made here in the United States. All this is American effort and uh, American product. So we're selling these for $19.11. 1911. That is not the cheapest decks of cards you can buy, but it's keeping our projects online. And when we talk about keeping our projects online, what am I talking about? You might not have remembered that I used to do a lot of videos on YouTube. Uh, our 5,000 something videos on the web 
uh, might be an indication of how prolific we can be uh, as a team here when we have a chance to do it. So one of the ways we're trying to fund those efforts is with these products at the, at the gear website store. And we're trying to encourage some sales tomorrow with these uh, tactical uh, stockings. So uh, some of the stuff we used to do, the uh, AK-47 bayonets. I don't know how interested you are in those, but I've got one of the largest collections still in the world, probably at least this country. And uh, I'm more than happy to share as I sell that collection off. Not because I don't like AK-47 bayonets anymore, but because I like 762 by 39 ammo even more. Having so much fun exploring the history of that and uh, acquiring bits and pieces here as I travel uh, to the various gun shows and gun shops. For example, this bag here is a bunch of 762 by 39 uh, brass in its uh, various stages of production. I almost forgot I acquired this, and I haven't even had a chance to turn a camera on, let alone open the bag and look at it myself, and that's because I'm constantly trying to keep the bills paid and uh, do that kind of thing. So uh, I'm hoping that we can uh, let people know that we've got all kinds of neat stuff to do off, off camera here that we'd be more than happy to uh, share. Uh, speaking of ammo collections, do you even know what my ammo collection looks like? Uh, really into the 50 BMG. Again, I've been able to acquire a lot of neat stuff. Uh, over the years as I've gone to the shows, but I don't have much chance to to share it because there's no actual profit in making videos on the internet, especially boring history videos like I do. So uh, again, purchases of the products, letting people know about our products, buying them as gifts, keep our project, our other projects going. I just stole a couple of hours last night in order to research more on the Bannerman family and the, the castle and the, the business and uh, ultimately fascinating. I can't wait to be able to uh, spend some real time on this. Uh, I'm having to get rid of some software and I'm trying to do some last minute projects before I have to let that, that software subscription go uh, and I'm kind of cramming uh, some projects in at the last part of 2018. I'd rather not have to be under time crunches. I'd rather you share a cup of coffee with me. If you think it's uh, a lot of people say, hey, I'd like to buy you lunch. Well, buy me lunch. Buy me a deck of cards, right? Uh, share those with somebody. Get our word out there. They've got your gun websites written on them. Uh, hopefully people see these and when you buy one and share it, uh, maybe that makes two decks down the road. And I don't have to keep talking about this stuff and I can keep talking about this stuff. The stuff that I'm interested in talking about. Stuff that I'm interested in sharing with everyone. And uh, the kind of stuff that we'll get back to eventually with your help. Thanks for watching.